Hello and good morning. Good morning. I think. So, Saturday. Saturday the 16th of May 2015. Time on the watch 06.43. Heading to the bus stop and already it's looking like a poor day. Plans not going very well. Email from Arriva Trains Wales. Points issues with the trains going to Cardiff until at least 10 o'clock. It's going to visit the new Cambrian Tap. Brains's craft beer bar. Used to be the Cambrian on Caroline Street. That's now not opening until Monday. However, I still have some Weatherspoons beer vouchers. So, I'll make up for it that way. And maybe the City Arms or the Cottage or the Urban Tap House or... Who knows? Uh, I have lots of podcasts. In a good mood. Not particularly grumpy. Tending to stay that way. However, only time will tell. Ah, the Ernest Willows. It's not actually 10 years since I started coming here. But May 2005, four Saturdays in a row. Which is like... the real start for me. I still love the players, despite its ups and downs. And... we're off. This is number one. Dragon Slayer, Banks and Taylor, 4.5% alcohol by volume. I'm saying Golden. Table number 9. Doesn't smell much. That's wrong. Low aroma. Mmm. Sharp and fruity. A nice bit of finish. B plus. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna struggle with this one. This is a strong mild. This is Black Bay by Bear Town. Five percent alcohol by volume. Five percent for a mild. Anyway. Mr. Manning alert, carpets and stuff. Mm, just a hint of aroma. Hmm. I like that. Actually, that tastes like a mild. Doesn't taste like a 5% mild, but it tastes like a mild. B. Number three. And I'm feeling it. Should have had more than a scotch egg for breakfast. Anyway, this is double header, as in the railway sort of terminology, by RCH, and this is 5.3% alcohol by volume. Amber ale? It looks amberish. Okay. Should have had a breakfast. No aroma. Maybe a little bit fruity, maybe a little bit spicy. I like it. B plus. There's someone over there wearing MTP. I think it works in the Innes Willows. Cottage. Oh, it's been since nine o'clock. That's a crack. Look, Mr. Manning. Will work. 
and then tails. Bragging rights, 5% alcohol by volume, and it brings glass. I may have had this before. Mmm, smells spicy. Mmm. It's spicy. B plus. Caroline Street. Okay, it doesn't open formally until Monday. But it has the word Cambrai in there. No craft. Never thought. Yeah. Chips. More chips. And some chips. Ha! Sunday. It's a follow on. 1910. 105 years old. Okay, um, 9.30, 17th of May, Sunday, 2015. Sunny. Although there's rain forecast for tomorrow. I'm gonna do a quick emergency Newport. Hopefully the return bus will be actually there. Who knows? So, springtime. Oh, the sun's gone in, so I better get in. It's a bit cloudy. Let's go. Yeah, cloudiness. Anyway, this is from Brecon Brewing, number one. 50p of this goes to some theatre thing in Brecon. So I'm helping people. Mind you, I did have a 50p off voucher. Which is 149. Footlit beacons, footlit beacons, sorry. Reckon growing 3.8% alcohol by volume, a very pale ale. It is pale. Hmm, smells spicy. It is spicy. Very Thin, but not bad. Actually, I quite like it. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Let's be generous. It's a B plus. That blue carpet means Tom Toyer Lewis. I need to go in the Queen's Hotel, but I gotta work on my uniques. Anyway, this is a unique. But it's slightly laid. This is on the fence by Brains, 4.1% alcohol by volume. An election thing you can't Number two. Number hmm. three. Smells like a bitter. Nice body. Nice bit. That punches above its weight. B. Plus. Nice long finish. Okay, so I've ordered turkey, but with extra beef. And a pint of white flanker, where we reference Rick War 4.3% alcohol by volume, not a unique. However, I seem to remember. That's a full body bitter, which it is. B plus. Lunchtime. <laughs> 